lovely guys, it is a rainy day today, oh my god. It's raining outside today, so it's very old terminal today, so anyway, I'm sorry I'm running off by. I'm just getting some work done, which we've already done, so it's about 9am right now, which I feel quite great, so if I manage to get some work done before 9am, so I'm feeling really great about that, but um, yeah, I'm just on the sofa right now, so just watching some TV really, just nothing much, um, yeah. Oh my god, look what I got! Starbucks. I got the entire autumn menu range. Not the entire autumn menu range, but some of the autumn menu range. I'm going to try them out today. So I'm going to do this for quite a while, but the Starbucks autumn menu for the UK hasn't come out until like last week. So um, yeah, we've always seen people try them, so I'm going to try it for myself. So got three bags full of Starbucks. Okay, so here's all the Starbucks drinks here, as you can see. So I'm going to take a look further. And they're all like pumpkin or maple syrupy flavoured drinks, so I'm actually really excited. I haven't actually tried Starbucks like autumn drinks in full before. And um, because last last year when I tried the Costa autumn drinks, it's because like the Starbucks doesn't open near me yet. It's like there wasn't a Starbucks near me at the time, but they've recently like opened a new Starbucks and now I can like get autumn Starbucks stuff on my doorstep. So whereas last year I would have had to like, travel on the train to the nearest Starbucks because no Starbucks was like miles away to me, but um to put these Starbucks in no, it's the best day ever. We have all these drinks here. And I've also had to get a pumpkin spice cookie as well. And it's like pumpkin spice marble loaf cake. So we're trying to drink this first though. So yeah. All right, so first up we have the pumpkin cream cold brew. It is, it's for the glory. So this is it, I'm gonna drink it. Are you scared? No, that tastes really nice actually. It tastes more like, I don't know, it tastes a mixture of hot dog sausages, pumpkin spice, ginger, and coffee. That's what it tastes of. It didn't taste very creamy, but it tasted of those combinations. That's how I would describe it being tasting like. Yeah, it's actually quite nice actually, I have to say. Okay, next up is pumpkin spice frappuccino. So it's like a frappuccino thing, but pumpkin spice version. So uh, I've got a straw here and the rest are like sippy cups, but this one needs a straw. So. That's really nice actually. It tastes very sugary. Like there's like lot it tastes like there's like lots of sugar in there, but it's like a very sweet pumpkin spice. It tastes like very sweet ginger. Um, but yeah, I actually I like it actually. It's like a nice creamy old thing. So look how aesthetically pleasing it is as well. Like I feel like I should be like going to a pumpkin patch right now, wearing like I don't know tartane or wearing like a cardigan or something, and going to a pumpkin patch and just like holding this and just like walking down the pumpkin patch. That is my dream. That's what my obsession is. Anyway, so next up is this is a salted maple and caramel cream cold brew. Um, it's actually quite new actually. I don't know if you've ever sold this thing before, so it's actually quite new for this year. So um, it's very creamy at the top, it's lots of creams. Mm. Yeah, it's not nice. Like if wood has a taste, like if wood was made into a drink, then this is what a taste of, so not a huge fan of this, so I have to say. Okay, so the last one is an iced decaf pumpkin spice latte. So, oh my god, this is most exciting because the Starbucks Autumn range is known for its pumpkin spice lattes, and that's what like everyone gets every year, but I haven't got the actual hot version, or got the iced version, so I think I had the pumpkin spice latte last year, and it tasted all right ish. Oh yeah, it tastes pretty alright actually. I'm very, very tangy as well. If like the ginger and the spice really sort of like lingered in, in your mouth for quite a while afterwards. Um, but yeah, it's actually quite nice actually. It tastes like a drink version of a gingerbread man, so pretty good. So we got the food now, so we got these cookies and we've got a pumpkin marble thing. I think it's actually called, yeah, pumpkin spice cookie. So, pretty simple. That's alright actually. The other thing is they've got raisins and I actually don't like raisins so that's the only thing I would like hold me back from it but other than that the pumpkin spice cookie is actually quite nice I have to say. Anyway so the last thing we're going to try for Starbucks Autumn range 
much is this pumpkin spice marble loaf cake. Yeah, pumpkin marble loaf cake. This is it. Uh, pretty good. Most of the icing's gone off though because it melted whilst so it was in like, transit. It's actually quite nice actually. Yeah, it's actually quite nice actually. I have to say, it's actually quite nice. It's just a lovely cake, so. So overall, a pumpkin, well, Starbucks autumn range is a very good autumn range, and I am in love, so. Um, yeah. All right, it's much later now, and I'm just looking at Christmas stuff right now, so. I grabbed it at the store. Thought, well, I'll grab up some Christmas decorations because I'm just gonna buy, like, I don't know, I have a sore throat today, and it's just like not felt too great so I thought you know what I need to look at Christmas stuff so I thought I'd just come here and have a look at some Christmas items which I have to admit for the time of year there isn't much out I have to admit there's a whole empty shelf thing there yeah, but there are some cute stuff here all the ones that go on it's like look at all that the cutest seems like a train nativity thing right here I'm back now from Christmas shopping. Well, like Christmas shopping is in buying Christmas stuff, but Christmas shopping is in like looking for, looking at Christmas stuff. So anyway, I'm back now, and I'm about to make Halloween fajita switch. To be fair, I haven't had Halloween fajitas in quite a while, but uh, I thought I'm making that. So yeah, I couldn't think of anything else to have. So I thought, well, I'll go my all-time classic favourite Halloween fajitas. I also got like smoky barbecue seasoning thing from Aldi as well. So I've not actually tried to like seasoning before, so it'd be good to try out see what it actually tastes of. So I'm just see what it tastes of really. Um, I'm gonna make this full of pizza now because I'm very hungry. I'm very hungry. Mm -hmm. 